Hey everybody, it's Maria from Magic the Amateur in here to do a Fate Reforged Cons Cons draft. Man, what do you even take? Oh, so much good stuff! If you know me, you know I love uh, Battle Brawler. This card is just my man. There's also Wild Slash, which is like insane in this format. Um, Flame Wake Phoenix, I think, is okay. Uh, um, I do like Gorse. I do like me a Gorse Wine. That's for sure. I'm going to take the Phoenix. <sighs> I honestly don't know if you should take Wild Slash over Flame Wake Phoenix, though. Um, that's a tough one. But I always err on the side of creatures because I'm a crazy creature person. Maybe we can play Blue Red Temple and my dream will live itself again. Um, like when I had the sweetest blue uh, red tempo deck I've ever had in my entire life. Uh, the other day it was, oh, it was so good. Okay, in here. What do we like, kids? Um, somebody like blew me out with this the other day. Not blew me out, but beat me. But this card is not good. <laughs> The good cards in this pack that I like are Just Guy Sage, Whisk Away, Sandblast, Hunt the Weak, uh, and the Caves. If I want to live the dream of Temple, I take the Sage or uh, Whisk Away. But Sandblast is like 5 damage, y'all. That's just the best card. Yeah. I mean, I could force it, but I don't know if these are good enough to force something for. Okay, there is no red in here, which is interesting. Um, this is a very good card in the tempo deck. Nobody cares about this dragon. Nobody cares about this hero's blade. Um, Soul Summons is an okay, you know, it's a bear with upside, potential upside. The Angler is good. I could just take the Cliffs um, and be like, five color, ma we could do five color madness. I mean, I don't know what else is better than that. This is interesting. Because there's a good, like, you know, tempo -y card in the Scout, and there's Teamer Battle Rage, which people are talking about now as being an actual card. Uh, and there's also Dulce and Gloom, which is very good. But we could just keep taking lands. <laughs> which is also very fun. Man, I don't know. These picks have not been easy to read for me at all. I believe in reading signals, so there's the pig friend. Maybe we just start taking lands. I don't want any of this particularly. interesting because there's good Mardu cards like War Flare and Harsh Sustenance. I do like a Sky Captain. I also kind of like these huge stone retainers if you're a cheap enough deck. Which whatever, you play them in a morph on turn 6, pretty strong. But Sky Captain is just annoying as all balls. Two sky captains, even more annoying. There's also typhoid rats. Notable. I mean, these are sky captains are better when you're winning. <laughs> I do like Sultan emissary. Here's a rune mark. I'm a sucker for that rune mark. 
Okay, so we've seen like zero red coming our way, which is notable, I suppose. Alicia's Vanguard, whatever. Um, but like, is this a card? If you're heavy black, I suppose it's okay, but if you're not, it's just really poor. In here, um, I don't know, I suppose we could take this rune mark. I mean, formless nurturing might be better. We have no green so far, but that doesn't mean like that it's not going to happen. Since we have primarily enemy colors, that means we can be uh, two different clans going into cons, which is good. Oh, look at that. Free land. If you manage to get ten lands, ten duels, you can play uh, five color. That usually means that you're getting all the sweet cards in the cons packs and you're able to, to take them because they go very late. Because people have been very narrow in their choices in Fate Reforge packs. And you're able to reap the rewards of that in the next two packs by having a million lands. But normally you like pick up a billion lands in Fate Reforge and that's like all you do. Look at my huge stone of trainers. Look at this, guys. They came to play. Like, if you imagine this card as a 4-4 four, four for 6, that also makes a 2-2. Two, two. Okay. Well, we have two really good removal spells here. In suspension Field and Debilitating Injury. And also an on-color card, you know, if we are in fact going to be um, Mardu, which, you know, I have absolutely no idea if we are. Uh, I think you have to take suspension field. It's just too good. <laughs> but, yeah, there's other good stuff in here that fits into our dex game plan. Hmm. Unexciting. But I'll take a death toucher. Ruth. We have nothing really super exciting going on in this deck right now. I mean... The most exciting thing is playing huge stone retainers on turn 4 with a ruthless return. <laughs> Ugh. Grody groad. It's... We're like black white warriors without any of the warriors. <laughs> Could just keep taking lands. But I think the time has passed for that to be something that we're doing. We got the throttle. We could take a smite. Or a bonkin. I saw somebody in chat refer to this as a bonkin. Like B-O-N-K-I-N. I thought it was so cute. Maybe we just need some better dudes. Here's another little bonkin. He played in a high spire mantis. I mean, you have to deal with that thing. But I'm just gonna stick on my colors here. a Mardu charm. Okay, so none of these lands are relevant if we are Mardu. A big pile of Mardu do more like. Sure, Behemoth, get in this party. We're never going to be able to activate this ferocious. Unfortunately.
Yeah, this card's pretty sick if you have Ferocious. There's a land we need. Blah, 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 just because you... Got some lurkers I could put in here. Lurking around. Steal this from somebody. Rare draft! Yum. That's cool art. It's a snake. Well, this is a dumpy pile. Maybe we'll get something really exciting. Like Sarkin! Or Wingmate Rock. That's what I really want. Once I uh, drafted Wingmate Rock, and I couldn't play it. <laughs> That was the saddest draft of my life. Pearl like ancient, why is it gotta be you? Sad. Well, I don't think we wanna be dead dropping with this deck. I suppose we could play Hordling Outburst, but like our red is so very light. There's feet of resistance, which I enjoy. So I'm gonna take that. Foil swap. We gotta remember that this guy's lurking. He's so cute. He's the cutest card of cons. P.S. Everybody, in case you didn't know. Um, I suppose we're gonna take this land, even though we maybe should take this Kieran. We gotta take the land. The Kieran's great, but like, look, here's another Kieran. One Watcher of the Roost, which I think people like better than this Kieran. But I think I like the Kieran better. We got in a lot of blue white duels. Tormenting Voice, I suppose. <coughs> Maybe be able to play that. Sarkin's gone bad. This is a delicious teamer card. Some more fixing. Now we don't have to worry about fixing and hopefully we can still get some um, stuff that's okay. Here's an arrow storm, which, you know, like I said, we're light on red, so it's a little tough, but it's just too good. cards are basically butts. Um, sure. Foil. Right? I can't even tell. <clears throat> uh, bring low, sure. I forget about this card sometimes. You guys, Foil Swamp came back around, but I'm stealing this boon. Because I hate this card against me. It's pretty easy to watch out for, but it's just so annoying sometimes. Like, if you, if you know it's coming, but there's like nothing you can do except not attack. says that the Goblin Slide deck um, got better with the addition of Fate Forged. I have never actually tried to play it. <laughs> There's this thing, Rush. I mean, okay. 
you never know. Here's our race for when someone plays a siege against us. <laughs> I was opening quite a few sieges when I first started playing Paper Forged online. I had the red siege a number of times. Guess what? Spoiler alert. It's pretty Well, you only have to, like, cut two cards. Because it's such a... This deck is such a butthole fest. <clears throat> Alright, Maria, it's not that big of a butthole fest. It's a pretty big butthole fest, but not that big. Okay. Okay, I just need one more cut. Uh, this thing? Just 12 creatures. That's crazy. Okay, let's try this. What lands does it want to give me? 4, 5, 6, 7 red, 5, 6, 7 black, 6, 7. That seems fine. I'm going to write these numbers down and go get some lands. So white, I have 6. Black, I have 5. Mountains, I have 4. Okay, I'm going to save this deck as, um, what should I call this deck? Mardu Poop. And go add some sweet-ass lands to it. 